German authorities say at least nine people have been killed in a head-on collision between two commuter trains. Among the dead are one of the two train drivers and two ticket inspectors. Around 150 people were aboard, according to officials who'd been on the scene in the state of Bavaria. Two people are missing, 15 are said to be in a critical condition and 40 seriously injured. German news agency DPA says another train driver is among the missing. All passengers have now been pulled from the wreckage. State rail company Deutsche Bahn says one of the trains appears to have been stationary when the other collided with it. One of the trains derailed and several carriages overturned. Rescue workers were on site within four minutes. The collision happened just before 7 a.m. on a curve on a single track near the town of Bad Eibling, 60 kilometres southeast of the city of Munich. Around 500 emergency services personnel were deployed. They've retrieved two out of three black boxes on the two trains. Officials have refused to speculate on the cause of the collision until the data boxes have been analysed. Joachim Herrmann, Bavaria's interior minister, said the scheduled timetable had not been respected, although it's unclear why. The stretch of track concerned had a 100 km per hour speed limit. An anti-collision system, which was installed on all German rail tracks following a 2011 crash, appears not to have been deployed. This would usually force trains to brake in the event of a missed signal.